Welcome Padawan. Today we're going to practice opening the hips and hamstrings with this short yoga practice. In order to get started, you're going to find a comfortable spot in the center of your mat and you're going to find a seat. What I'm going to have you do from here is just focus on your breath. Inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth as we get set up for the first posture of the sequence, seated butterfly. So take a big breath in, connect your feet together and exhale. Find that seated butterfly position, open your knees out wide, sit your chest up tall, reach your head up towards the ceiling, and find a nice, slow, cadenced breath. You must unlearn what you have learned. Take a breath in and then rotate on your mat to find happy baby. You're going to bring your knees into your shoulders, grab for the inside or outside arches of your feet, and then bring your knees in towards your armpits to feel the stretch in your hamstrings. You can also grab for your ankles if flexibility is a challenge for you. Take a breath in and exhale. Send your left leg long, bring your right knee into your chest. Wrap your hands around your shin and pull your toes towards your face. Take a breath in and exhale into a figure four position. Place your right ankle across your left knee and then bring your left leg in towards your chest. You can wrap your fingers around your left hamstring and bring it in a little bit closer. You wanna feel this stretch on the outside of your right hip. Now focus on your breath. Yes, Jedi's strength flows from the force. Take a breath in and exhale. Unhook that right foot, let it go long and bring your left knee into your chest. Wrap your fingers around your left shin and pull that knee in towards your chest for a hamstring stretch. Take a breath in and exhale as you put your left ankle across your right knee. Wrap your fingers behind your right hamstring and bring your right knee into your chest, feeling this stretch on the outside of your left hip. Take a breath in and exhale into a glute bridge. Press your heels into the ground, drive your hips up into the air and keep your abs flexed, breathing in and out through the nose. Take a breath in and exhale as you roll over, plant your hands on the mat, tuck your toes and push up into a downward facing dog. Push the floor away, soft bend to your knees to allow your hips to go up one to two inches higher. Train yourself to let go of everything you fear to lose. Take a breath in, and with that inhale, lift your right leg high, exhale, step that right foot in between your hands. If you have blocks, you can use blocks. What you're gonna do is plant your hands firmly into the ground, straddling your right foot, and then I want you to engage your left glute. That's gonna bring a stretch to your left hip flexor, and I want you to drive that right knee underneath your chest and anchor in through the heel. From here, take a big breath in 
and exhale, stand up into a crescent lunge. Your feet are gonna remain in the same spot. I want you to sink into that right knee, continue to squeeze your left glute, continue to feel that stretch on your left hip flexor, and then keep your arms reached up overhead. Exhale to knit your rib cage down and hold here. Take a breath in and exhale into warrior two. Right foot will remain in the same place. You'll bring your left foot to be perpendicular so that the heels connect with each other. Reach your arms out parallel to the floor, gaze over your right arm, and then drive that right knee open to feel a stretch on the inside of your right groin. A Jedi uses the force for knowledge and defense. Never. Take a breath in and then exhale into a side lunge. Grab your blocks if you need to. Your left heel can come up, but you're going to slide on over into a side lunge and hold a squat on that left leg. The right leg will stay open. You can have a soft bend to the knee, but you're gonna hold here and feel this stretch in the right groin. Take a breath in and exhale, rotate into a high lunge with your left foot forward. You can use the blocks if you need to, but again, frame your left foot with your hands, keep your chest and spine long, lift that right heel and engage your right glute to keep that right hip flexor stretched. Take a breath in, exhale, rise into crescent lunge, feet stay anchored, let that bend in your knee, get a little bit deeper on the left leg, keep your right leg straight and engaged, lift the right heel and raise your arms up overhead. Take a breath in and exhale, spin into warrior two with your left foot forward. Right heel is gonna be parallel to the back of the mat, perpendicular to your left foot. Reach your arms long and gaze over the fingertips of your left hand. Sing into that left leg a little bit deeper and make sure that that left knee doesn't collapse in towards the toe, drive it open towards your left pinky toe. Take a breath here and exhale as you slide into a side lunge on your right leg. You can come up on your toes and lift the heel of your right foot and then keep that left leg long, really focusing on the stretch of your left groin. Take a breath in, exhale, downward facing dog, rotate, send your right foot back, bend both knees to send your hips up one to two inches higher, and then press firmly into both hands and allow your head to relax. Take a breath in, exhale, forward fold, bring your feet in between your hands. Take a breath in and exhale, grab a block if you need to and sit into the deepest squat you can possibly get into without pain. You might bring your knees out a little bit wider, you might come up on your toes, but fight to keep your chest tall and use your arms to get those knees a little bit wider so that you can get that stretch on the groin a little bit more. Big breath in, 
exhale, stand up into mountain pose, rotate your pinkies in towards one another, plant firmly into your feet, spread your toes out wide, and keep your core engaged as you breathe slowly here. Take a breath in, exhale, bring your hands to heart center, close your eyes and focus on your breath, the force flowing in and out of you. There is no emotion, there is peace. There is no ignorance, there is knowledge. There is no passion, there is serenity. There is no chaos, there is harmony. There is no death, there is the Force. 